Hi, good morning. Welcome to Tuesday. Technically Monday for a lot of you. Some of you, most of you had the day off. We did not. We got busted on one leg of our parlay. It sucks. It happens. The Angels, they just exploded. And we weren't prepared for that. We were prepared for the Angels winning the game by all means. So we're back. We're suited up. We're ready to go. Another three-leg parlay. If you're new to the video, you know the drill here. You just see it. Three-leg parlay. That's what we're going to do. And if you're brand new, we supersize the shit out of this sucker once we give you the three legs on DraftKings. So I only ask really a couple of things, right? You hit the thumbs up button. You are subscribed here to the Odd Shop for channel nearly 18K by the time that I did this video this morning. So I know you're out there. You're following. You're part of this Odd Shopper community. It's awesome. Absolutely awesome to have you on board. So thank you first and foremost and continue to be a part of this thing by interacting. Any comments you have on the chat, we love, love to see it. Good, bad, or ugly, we'll take it in any capacity. Today is all about revenge. Not really, but we're going to bill it as the revenge tour. You have a couple of interesting scenarios here where it's just guys going up against their former teams. I don't think Matt Olson is angry by any means that I oh, freaking A's or anything like that. I get to just go back there. I mean, I'm sure he's very thrilled in the situation that he is right now. So we're going to go over one and a half total bases for Olsen right away. Again, this isn't revenge in the sense of like, man, you guys screwed me over. I'm coming back to show you up. Olsen is just 10 times better off where he is now as opposed to where he was. So I think looking at this, it's a great chance because you know it's going to be talked about. You know it's going to be an opportunity here. You know it's going to be built into the game and everything else with a discussion, of course. His teammates are going to want to see that happen. Over one and a half total bases. You get me a double from Matt Olson against his former squad. I mean, just think about that. Let's say that out loud. His return to Oakland, and he gets a big night, I'm sure. All we need is a double. That's it. Or two singles, mind you. We'll do that. That's fine. I wasn't even asking for something in the second at bat. I was just saying, you give me a double right away. Triple, you want to leg out a triple, knock one out of the hell. Well, go ahead, knock one out of the park. That's fine. But the first play for us on this three leg parlay is going to be Matt Olson in the revenge tour, part one, going over one and a half total bases. I can't help myself. There were a couple of other options. Look, Wade Miley is on the hill. Now, we can't take at the moment Wade Miley's K's, which I think you can't go high enough. Miley against the Reds. It just writes itself. The Reds strike out left and right. Miley has pitched well outside of just being on the injured list all year. So getting him healthy the first time back with the expectation that he's healthy enough to pitch is where I want to be. So let's do it. A same game parlay. This is going to be our same game parlay X because we're going to add a same game parlay sandwiched between two other plays that are just solo. All right. What I want to do here is target Wade Miley without playing Wade Miley. So I'm going to go for the Chicago Cubs, at least. I'm going to look at, you know, that's out of Wade Miley's control. But keeping the Reds under two and a half runs for the majority of Miley's outing, at least, I think is a doable ask. So we'll stay under two and a half runs. I don't think the Reds explode by any means. I think it's a tough game for them at the plate. Miley's going to do enough work. I don't think he's on a pitch count, any count, et cetera. So if he goes deeper, it's only a matter of a positive for us that we get less of that bullpen. So I think we'll be fine overall with both Miley and the pen behind it. Under two and a half is the first leg of this same game parley inside the X. Now, what I also want to do is just recognize that if I'm going under two and a half, there's a pretty good opportunity here for the Cubs to win this game on the run line. And that's ex exactly what I need. So that's going to get me to plus 260 here. And the two-leg parlay, Olsen and the same game parlay to the, make the same game parlay X, is at plus 656. So we don't need anything crazy. Reminder, we're going to supersize the hell out of this sucker in just a minute. We don't need anything crazy. This isn't revenge on the Pittsburgh Pirates as it's the first time the Mets and Pirates will face each other, right? This isn't revenge 
on Pittsburgh or Mitch Keller, mind you. This isn't revenge across the board. It's just revenge against the league. I think the Mets right now are pissed off. I think the Mets right now have been cooped up. They were embarrassed and then humiliated back-to-back by the Nationals at home, of course. So clearly a talk of the division slipping away, a talk of another major epic Mets collapse is being discussed. And it's not just in Queens that this stuff is happening, all right? The conversations are everywhere. The Mets are a popular team. Everybody is talking about this possible implosion. They were prime to come out on Monday and explode the rain sweeps into Pittsburgh and causes a delay. I think to get this game in, the Mets right here at minus 225 are fine just to win the game. That brings us to plus 885, all right? Mets to win, flat out money line. Same game parlay, Reds, Cubs, under two and a half total for the Reds. Cubs minus one and a half. And then over one and a half for Matt Olson. So that's the same game parlay X, the baseline, if you will. Let me tell you what's going on here at DraftKings. It's a very simple process, right? You can see what's below me. If you haven't read that, go ahead. You can read it as I speak. I'll even read it with you. Bet at least $5 on any NFL or college football game. Win $200, and the link is below. See, you didn't even need to read. I was doing the work for you. That's the nature of our business here, right? on the Odd Shopper channel. We're just doing the homework for you because we love you and we know that you have more important jobs than to sift and comb through information. So when you head on over to DraftKings, clicking that link, it's so simple. You $5, right? Your $5. Win or lose is going to turn into 200 back into your account. So you can still win that bet. You want to go big on a huge dog week one or college football. Will you probably find an even bigger payout for a dog? Absolutely. Go ahead. Check Jeski, Check Raza. Check these guys on betting you if you like some advice as far as a major payout on just a $5 bet on a college game. But again, win or lose, and it's right back into your account. So we love that. We love to see when DraftKings is giving back. All right, let's get rid of the Mets game to win flat out. Taiwan Walker, Mitch Keller. Now, I don't think we need to get super nuts here, but we are going to take the Mets on the run line minus one and a half. And you know, with Walker on the hill, I don't think we can expect, we nor should we expect, a big game from the Pittsburgh Pirates overall, including the pen there. So we'll go under three and a half runs total for the Mets. Now, that's not fantastic, right? Because we're in an action-required state. So unfortunately, we can't take that out. It's not going to let us, but I'm fine with that. I'm fine with the minus three and a, under three and a half, minus one and a half there for plus 125. All right, the Reds, I'm going to keep that the same in regards to this same game parlay. Although, actually, you know what? Let's let's have some fun with this because I think we can add one more leg to this. Now, again, we're not going to get much, right? So let's first off take the Cubs on an extended game line here, alternate at minus two and a half. And we'll keep the Reds as far as an underplay for a game prop under two and a half runs. So that should, yeah, plus 320. Now, plus 125, plus 320. We're sitting at plus 20, plus 2016. Let's get rid of Matt Olson because I want to keep Matt Olson in there, right? This is going to be geared, fueled by Matt Olson revenge. Of course, it's not really revenge, but it's revenge here. Let's get back to this game. Let's get into his same game parlay. We'll go right to total bases and get Matt Olson at two plus because I think that's where we want to begin. We wanted to keep that in there. Two plus at plus 110. That's fine. Braves on the road. You know they're going to win this game. Win one for the Gipper. So let's push this here to two and a half. That's all. Uh, look, they're minus one and a half. All I'm going to do, folks, is just push this to minus two and a half. Nothing wild, nothing crazy. We have Olson in there. Two plus total bases, minus two and a half. Now, that's three straight. And look, this just bumped up. That's three straight same game parlays to build a massive same game parlay X. So the Mets minus one and a half, under three and a half for the Pirates total runs. The Cubs minus two and a half run line, under two and a half total runs for Cincinnati. That's at plus 370. And then the last leg here is we keep. Matt Olson revenging the hell out of the A's 
and keep the Braves winning the game, but we stretch that alternate line to minus two and a half. Now, this thing is going to be massive. This is a plus 4152. That's 41. If you're betting $10 uh, parlay, which it should be, we're putting a tenth of a unit on these each and every day. That's 41 shows you just made up. 41 and a half, technically. You just made up with one. That's all we need. Let's get this. Let's get this. I got a good feeling. Everybody's back to work. School's back. Let's do it all. Hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe. Make sure you hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything at all as far as a prop, a line, odds that shift. Look at that. Plus 4152. I want to end on that. I want to end looking at that. 4152. Let's cash these tickets.